facilities and more facilities. That is what the athletes need because you're saying that you're trying as much as possible to train, but you're having quite a number of difficulties uh, just as we try to sharpen our arsenal and get ready to represent uh, this uh, country. Kesef's member of parliament on, this, on his side is saying that, yes, this is a big mess that needs to be fixed. And he's saying, as a country, we have potential, we have the money. It is only goodwill that is lacking for the country to build the stadia that our athletes so much desire. If we sit down and collect, uh, we have enough land. Land is so much, unlike India, China. We have land, we have uh, goodwill, we have talents. The only the is the, is, the, is, the, 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 is, the, is the infrastructure. It can be done, but uh, I think your, uh, your interview to me as opening my eyes and uh, a skillful young boys, girls in five acres land. If we can't do an infrastructure, it will go a long way. And we can do it. I agree with you. Where there's a will, there's a way. Why cannot we do for our children? Corona taught us a lot of things. Today we are there, tomorrow we are not there. Where we take this money? So let us, whatever small we have, let us say for our children. They are our children. Let me tell you, this boy, this young, uh, these athletes, they brought glory. And uh, today, because of various reasons, they have constraints for livelihood. Some of them, they don't have a good piece of meal uh, twice in a day. So we should not forget them. The people who brought glory to Kenya, who doesn't know Kenya? Who doesn't know what is Kenya? Who doesn't know what the Kenyans are? 20 years back, 30, 25 years, 23 years back when I came to Kenya, Kenya to India and Kenya now to Indians, the Kenya, is a different Kenya. Kenyans are the most disciplined, hospitable, bright, aggressive, great brains of the world in various aspects. Kenyans are excelling in IT. Case the Kenyans are excelling in, in, in technology, in doctor, hospital, health. Kenyans are excelling in diplomats, world diplomats. But what we are lacking, we are lacking, we don't recognize ourselves. So these young athletes, please if we make a uh, sako or something for them and uh, some, some sort of uh, assistance, there are not many. There are not many, 200, 300 people, or maybe 500 people, maximum, those who brought the glory. You understand? Uh, there are not many from 65 now. So if we take care, it's not, it's, 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 it will be a great way, long way, and God will love us. It's a very good idea and timely to have a world-class uh, stadium, world-class, like Germany like uh, like uh, American stadiums or like to that matter Chinese or Indian stadiums we can make it where there is a will where there is a way if Kenya government has 20 percent we we all leaders will look for money all over the world every country every ambassador should come and solicit give us some money so this is the place for the world people globally People will come, they enjoy the sports and games, they will enjoy athletics, they will enjoy the tourism, they enjoy the, our wildlife, they enjoy the hospitality of great people of Africa, Kenya, Kalenjin. Now also, Kenya and as a county and as a country, we will get a lot of revenues. If five, six big tournament in the world, global tournament, championship here, Imagine, 20,000 people will come, not only players, but coach, uh, visitors, viewers, their officials, the diplomats. How busy will be the place? How many hotels do we need? How many convention centers do we need? How many restaurants do we need? How many nightclubs do we need? How much money will be generated? How many travel, Kenya travel will happen? So now, everything will be so every city in the world has their recognition health city it city sports city uh -huh. 
mineral city, pharmaceutical city, uh, automobile city. So it will be a city for the champions. We talk football, shall we? And there is a plenty that is happening and a lot of local football, uh, Kenya.